Hey, it's Mike and John from PumaPlow.com playing some farming simulator on the Xbox 360. Here in? All over the place. I'm in Hagen uh, I'm at Westbridge. So. I'm legally obligated to say, you know, Hagen so, Are you? Yeah, definitely. So, since last video, I finished, uh, planted this field again, field 16. Oh, yeah. And I sold my croppage. Okay. I was able to buy the small case combine, the 7130. Ooh. Yeah. The field's ready to harvest. We're going to knock it out again. Hashtag jelly. And you know, well, here's the bad part. If I was paying attention, yeah, I probably could have bought the big case. Oh, really? But I had in my head that the big case cost what the New Holland cost on 15. Oh, yeah. And I was yeah. like, there's no way it's half a million dollars, but it's not. No. So it would have been, been really close. Okay. So the other thing I did is I upgraded my running tractor, even though it's a cheaper tractor, to another Schluter. Yeah. So it, it saves me like 20 grand. Oh, wow. And it's faster than that Booher, and it's cheaper on maintenance. Yeah. So for all and, those reasons, I swapped it out. And it's a Schluter. And it's a Schluter, yeah. Schluter. So, like, so basically, I only have three pieces of equipment anymore. Me too. I have two little Schluters and um, the, the case combine. That's all I have. I've got two Urses and a combine. So, But you're you, winning because your combine's bigger. You're rocking the small Deutz, right? Yeah. Yeah. For now. Well, yeah, clearly. but I, my map's going to be slower to get going because I have less croppage and right, and you have a lot more, you know, turning and yeah. Well, my yield's so much less too. Right. You know? Well, you're doing canola, so that's good. Yeah, I've got I'm, my three fields planted in canola. I'm doing Barney. Barney. Uh, yeah, barley. That sounds weird. Sounds a little dirty. You're doing Barney. so. My theory right now, though. Yeah. On this map is I'm going to hold this equipment. Yes. Until I can get field 17 bought. Okay. I can do fields 16 and 17 with this equipment. Yeah, yeah definitely. It'll be a little slow, yeah. but it'll be fine. I'll, I'll totally rock it out like this. Sure. And then I'm gonna. my next goal is to actually buy a second big combine. Okay. Probably go right to the, the big case with the big head. Yeah, and have both of them at the same time. Rock a big and a little for now. And yeah. then we'll upgrade planners and you know all the other stuff. Okay. Because the planner's going to need a bigger tractor. Yeah, definitely. You know, um... So I get the condor. Actually, you know, the uh, the Schluter will pull the condor. Will it? It's not pretty, but it'll do it. Okay. So, anyway. So should I buy the one meter? Dear God, no. Or the 1.2 meter? Is there a bigger one? Well, but I have a nurse's and I have them on a very strict budget of less than $7,000. Wait, what's the small? Is that the smallest one up top, that Pottinger? Yeah, it's 20 grand. Oh, I now. thought there was another one. That's only that. 2.1 meters. I'd buy the, that Lemkin there. Yeah, that one. It's only one, $150. Yeah. So. $150. More than the other one. I was like, it's yeah. not $150. No, I know. But yeah, okay. I would buy that one and move on. All right, we're going to see. Because you're going to plow those two fields together, correct? Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and buy a front weight, too, because. Uh, it's your fertilizer. Fertilizer's not a very good front fertilizer. weight. Fertilizer. No. Hey, you know what? What's I that? missed the inspector mod right now. See, I never thought I would say that. Uh huh. Oh no, we got but a problem. I kind of miss Inspector Mod right now. You've got a problem. What's the matter? I'm blocking traffic, and it's gonna mess up my combine here in a second. Oh no! So I need to get the planner. Planner's blocking traffic. Oh, I hate when that happens. Yeah, because I don't want to get him quite going quite yet. Yeah. So I was actually thinking about doing some experiments with the traffic on there. Okay. Mostly on Westbridge because it's not an issue here in Hagenstaber. Are right. Uh, about putting like front weights randomly around the map and see if the traffic stops and stuff. I bet it would. Yeah. Hey, you know what? These controls are way more sensitive on the PC. You know, it's Jeez. different. We just played VPC Farm Sim. We did? Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. And uh, every time I go into the shop, I keep wanting to reach for my keyboard. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> like when you go into the settings. Yep. To so like, like fast time and stuff, you're like, uh, set no. Keyboard would be great. Uh-huh. <laughs> Oh, wait. This combine's great. That's all I can tell you right now. I'm sure it is, yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, I've not actually really used that combine on this game. You know, that was part of the reason I wanted to buy it, too. I've done some PPLTs with it back when I did them on 360. Yeah. And it's it's a solid combine. It's basically that 9230, but smaller. Yeah. A little shorter pipe. You know, it doesn't quite hold as much. It holds, like, I want to say holds in the tent, like 10,000 area. See, that's not bad. Where the big one holds 12.3. Yeah, that's not too so bad. So it's not bad. No. Um... So, yeah, I'm gonna go remind myself what Field 17 costs too. A lot. It's like 175 million dollars. I don't think it is, John. Oh. So. 171 million dollars. It is 198. Oh wow! Yeah, I can't afford that. You're Ouch. right. Thank you. <laughs> I think I'm gonna do a double barley harvest. Don't you love when the game's like, nah? It's like seriously dumbass. Nah, it's so much. 
So I think I'm going to do a double barley. Yeah, you might as well. And then sell it, and then I should be able to buy that field. Okay. And then do, like, um, canola or something. Yeah. You know. Pretty much. Something along those lines. Man, I want to zoom out so much farther, too. I know. That's why I'm sticking with just two trailers. <laughs> well, I'm not even using it, especially on the canola harvest. I don't need it. True. But I just, I don't know. I like. You know what you should have done? What's that? Should have done the ends of both those fields and started plowing. Oh, trust me. I, I just thought of that. Okay. Yeah. I think I'll do the end of the next field. Sure. So as he's running over there, I can uh, start plowing. Okay. Because, you know, allegedly I like to get my cedar going one of these days. I'm going to do that right now. But I need that tractor to plow, so. Oh, yeah. You're sh- only, short a tractor. I only have the two, so. And you're out of money. I am down so. to $2,500. <laughs> nice. Almost twenty six. I think I'm starting the cedar a little early, but we'll give it a whirl. You know, probably not, though. That that combine's going to roll. Yeah, but I go 11 in this and only 6 in the combine. Fair play. So I think I'm going to go ahead and stop him, actually. Yeah. <laughs> so. All right. I love the tabbing, though, with only having, um, you know, three pieces of equipment. Yeah, it's great, right? Yeah. Compare that bad. to, like, Texas, where it's tab all day. Pretty much. All day. Every day. Every day. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So, have you seen that game City Skylines yet? Nope. No? Nope. It's like SimCity, but better. Okay. You actually have to lay water pipe. You have to lay your electric lines. It's like Prison Architect. It's kind of, yeah, but you build towns. Well, you're building a town in Prison Architect. Fair play. I mean, but you can technical. You can build, like, dams on the river. Oh, wow. And then if you, like... Destroy the dam. Oh, there goes your town. That's awesome. <laughs> it sounds like fun, but I didn't want to pay for it, so I was going to wait for it to go on sale. You know a game I might buy tonight? What's that? Or tomorrow, maybe? What's that? Guacamelee. Guacamelee? Yeah, it's like a platformer based on like Mexican uh, wrestlers and stuff. Really? Yeah. It's been out for a while. Okay. It's on the one. It's on sale now. It's six bucks. Is it supposed to be an easy thousand pointer? No. Well, yeah, but it's just a fun game. <laughs> oh, okay. I haven't so. actually seen that. Yeah, it's been out for a while. Uh, is your one down here or is it upstairs? Nah, it's upstairs. Yeah, okay. I've actually been playing on it. I played some GTA the other night. Did you really? Working on the campaign. Whoa. Yeah, I played like three missions. I didn't see that. Uh, You were probably at the farm. It was... It probably was, yeah. What night was that? I've, Monday or Tuesday night? You just name a night this past week I've been at the farm, so... Sure. Yeah. I, it, basically, that's true. So. But, uh, yeah, I played for like... An hour or so. Wow. I figured I'd do the, the campaign in batches like that, you know? Sure. So. Yeah, you'll get through it eventually. Yeah. I mean, I'm struggling the campaign too, so. Yeah, but you've already played it once. I haven't. Yeah, so. I, I've played it once, but I'm still nowhere near where I need to be. I'm trying to catch up to where I was on the 360. Sure. Because, like, I did, I just met Lester. Oh, okay. With Michael. Yeah. So, I'm not that far into it, obviously. Yeah. So. See, I'm I'm just into the Trevor part. Yeah. See, I haven't even I haven't even unlocked Trevor yet. Oh wow. Well. So. Right. Yeah. So I figure you know just hour here, hour there. I'll I'll get there. Yeah, you will get there eventually. So. You know. About twenty, thirty hours later, you know, you'll get there. Right. What? Well, however, however long that campaign takes. I'll get there. Still need to play the heist on the one. Yeah, I do too. Only played the first one. I've played uh, so, three of them or four of them now on the 360. I'd like to have some more monies. Um, <laughs> it's pretty fun, but. It's hard getting a good group of four people together to right. that stay. Especially on the one. Yeah. You know? Yep. Because I don't even know five people, <laughs> much less to have ones. Yeah. That was funny, right? I know people. That was funny, right? Sure. And then to add insult to injury, our 10-year-old nephew, 9-year-old nephew. Yeah. He unfriended me on the Xbox. Rude. Yeah. Apparently he was upset. You were telling me that... Uh, I was getting a lot of achievement points. I played that Fast and Furious game, which is a blast, by the way. Yeah. Well, he was upset because we were getting achievements and we weren't playing with him. Because we were playing that Fast and Furious game, which it's I guess there's player. there's multiplayer. There's multiplayer, too, but, it. but there's no achievements in it. So exactly. So why play multiplayer? Right. Yeah, that Fast and Furious game is actually a lot of fun. It kind of makes me want to buy Forza Horizon 2. No. Nah. But at the same time, like, nah. It's a fun game. I mean, I'm not much of a race car type game. Yeah. Or, because I'm really bad at them. Yeah. But if I can thousand point that game and do it in like three hours. And you have, right? Oh, yeah, I'm done. Yeah. I'm pretty sure anybody can thousand point that game if I can do it. Yeah. The, and it's, it's a lot of fun. The one about the point combo one has me right now. Oh, it's now. easy. I'll show you how to do it. Oh, sorry. I just, I haven't Googled it yet. I'll show you how. There's a race to do it in, actually. Yeah, I was going to Google it. and, and Use the Jeep. 
Okay. And there's a race. Th- it's when you. It's part two of beat the Cuda, or get the Cuda or whatever it is. Okay. And it's like an off roady type race. Oh. So you don't worry about winning. Yeah. Okay. But you just stay back and you draft off of people. No. Oh. You drift around some corners and it's real hilly. Okay. Or bumpy, so you get a lot of air, which keeps your point combos going. Oh. And then you pass people occasionally to get the the pass bonus. Okay. And then don't wreck. And as you get going, you get a multiplier. Multiplier, not a multiplayer. Yeah. You get a multiplier on your points. Okay. And so then when you get to 50,000, you just stop. Because then it'll it'll stop 50, the 50,000 as much as you need? Yeah. Huh. So when you get to 50,000, you stop because then that turns off the bonus. Sure. And then it re- registers it, and then you get the achievement. Oh, wow. And then you finish the race. You know what? I think that was my problem because I'm pretty sure I had one that was over 50. Yeah. But I wrecked. Yeah, as soon as you wreck it, you lose your points. Yeah. So when you get to 50, you stop. Collaborate and listen. Hammer time. I don't know. Sure. All those. Uh, all the above. Yeah, pretty much. And then you, uh, yeah, and then it'll, it'll put it up on the screen. Oh, okay. I was annoyed because uh, my personal best before that was like 48,000. Oh, wow. I was like, are you serious? <laughs> I was so annoyed. Yeah, I can but, see that. But, you know, it worked, so. Yeah, I was having fun with that game the other day when I was playing. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. I've only played it like twice, I think, now. Uh-huh, and you have all but three achievements. Yeah. I looked at them the other day to see how, so. how you were doing. Yeah, so. I just don't get on my wonder. Actually, we were playing Farm Sim on the server, mm-hmm. and uh, my job was to empty trucks when they needed to be emptied, so I had plenty, and we were harvesting canola. Yeah. So I fired up my Xbox One on my other monitor. Sure. <laughs> I had plenty of time to kill, so. Looks like your plowing's going well. It's Slowly, though. Well, you know, 1.2 uh, meters at a time here. It happens. You see. Yeah. It's a lot like our plow, a little 314 or something. And you still have to uh, empty your trigger combine, too. Eventually, yeah. yeah. I probably should get over there. Oh, he's not at 80 yet. Well, that's good. So I'm good for now. I'm rolling over here, just saying. Oh, I bet you are with that big old combine. Uh-huh. Definitely. Now my planner has to catch up. Yeah. So, which I think he will, because he's going so much faster. I'm sure. You know, it's all about the Schluter, John. All about that Schluter. All about it. About that Schluter. You know, the other good thing about this game compared to 15. Oh, uh, what's that? In your hired workers, you can still turn their beacons on after they're hired. Oh, yeah, if you're riding with them, yeah. Yeah, if you're riding with them. It's very important. Yeah, it's kind of annoying on 15, you can't. Yeah. And you know, the Schluters have good beacons, so. Yes. Not really. They have beacons. They're all the same beacons, I know. I'm well pretty, aware. Pretty much, yeah. Although, you know, if you play on 15 using course play, you can turn their beacons on, I think. Yay. I haven't messed with it much yet, though. Or, okay, let's put it this way. I messed with it for like two hours the other day. That's not really that much. Though. I couldn't get it to work very right. well. Two hours isn't much to learn course play. No. I'm sure there's a video somewhere. I'm, you know, what is my problem here? I keep going more than speed one. What are you doing? I, I'm sure there's a lot of videos out there to watch, but mm-hmm. uh, I was just trying to learn it. Sure. A little bit, because it's fun to mess with. Yeah. I had a auger wagon empty in a combine. He would empty into a truck, and then the truck would go run when he got it like 80%. Nice. It was pretty cool. I so missed. in case you're curious, which I know you're not, but whatever. Okay. This this 7130, using it with the in-game head. Oh, One yeah. One of the DLC packs came out with a really big head. And that combine. That's and this combine. Time. Yeah, they were in a pack together, which makes no sense. Yeah. Because that head wouldn't work. It would work. You just wouldn't be able to empty. Yeah. So this is this this is the in-game. It's like a 10-meter head or 10.2 or something. Yeah, whatever it is, yeah. Save the big head, which is 13.7 or something. Yeah. Save it for the, uh, for the big case, which I'll get eventually. Eventually. Yep. And I did know that, actually. You told me about this the other day. Yeah. That you had bought that combine, so. It's the only way to go with, with this combine. Oh, yeah. So, big head would be great, but it's just too much. It, it is simply too so. much for that combine to handle. I mean, the combine will handle it. You just can't empty. Yeah, it just looks weird. You'd have to, like, back into the side of the combine or something. Ooh. And that would, yeah, that would just be weird. Ooh. So, yeah. No, this way. I'm having an argument with myself of which way the plow should be turned. Apparently. It Putting uh, 37,000 liters into storage, by the way. Nice. I haven't put anything into storage yet. Mainly because I kind of forgotten about my complaint. I was like, isn't he ready to be emptied yet? Probably not. With your sweet tippers, though, man. Um, I don't know. Has he stopped? He stopped. Oh, no. Oh, no. Come on, John. Ew, ew. This is basic heart farming 101. Well, you know, I was trying to get my plowing done, all right? If only there was multiplayer, right? I know. Yeah, I wish. In another month or so, there will be. Yeah, on the Xbox One. Then we can retire this game again. <laughs> Pretty much, right? 
We're never playing. Although this time we won't come back to it because there's no reason to. I need to. Oh, no, no, never mind. I won't be playing on the 360. Never mind. You know? Yep, I agree. I, I do have a thought about the 360 version, though. Oh, God. I'll save it for after this video. Yay. <laughs> I, I think it's a great idea. Whee. Just saying. Whee. And they don't turn their beacons on when they get um, near full. Right, that's a on 15. This version. That's a 15 thing. Which is lame-o. All these urses are snappy still. So. <laughs> I'm happy with that. Looks like you're making some progress. I'm 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 doing something. Well, you got your end rows done now, so it'll start going faster. Yeah, you're doing able to do some longer passes. Hopefully. Get a bigger plow. I I can't afford it. I'm hashtag broke over here. You're hashtag poor. <laughs> Seriously, you are not hashtag blessed. No, unless blessed with like poverty. Wow. Which I don't think that's very blessed no, right there. No, I don't so. think so. No. Your hashtag poverty blessed. I think wow. that's a new insult. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure. I yeah. wish I could cut these trees down too. By the way, you can't. It sucks. That's why I was glad you wanted to play on Hagenstad, not me. <laughs> I hate the trees on that map. I mean, it's, it's kind of my thing. You know, I'll play on Westbridge all day long. I like Westbridge. It's better than Hagenstad. I actually found a new or was sent a new uh, Westbridge edited map for 15. Yeah. Uh, somebody took it, grassed every field, except for they left a border, so you could plow them back if you wanted to. That's nice. And then treed the entire map. Oh. So. That sounds awful. It sounds amazing. No. I, think, I don't think you know what amazing means, John. So when I get uh, the Epic Harvest, oops, that was the wrong button. I got out of my tractor. When I get the Epic Harvest done. Yep. On Texas, that's going to be our next, like play around thing I'm busy whenever there's nothing going on in the server I'm busy ah, it's fun it's gonna be fun I'm, I'll run loads exactly there's always something for somebody to do but there won't be that many people in there at once because of like the leg like a fat kid because I'll be hosting that off my machine locally so yeah uh huh that could be really laggy at times oh yeah so. totally you should sell all the logs you know <laughs> That, that's what we were doing the other night. We started it, and uh, I had two people in, and myself, and I was actually streaming it on my channel. Why not on Puma Plus channel? Because I was only streaming for like five minutes. Oh. I just wanted to see how laggy it would get for the guys. Yeah. I, it was a test. That's what my channel's for. Of the emergency broadcast system? No, of the oh. hashtag charter sucks internet. That's what it was a test of. That one too. Yep. Yeah. So, but they said with two people and, and streaming, it wasn't leggy for them. So I was kind of impressed with that. Well, that's good. So. I'm hemorrhaging money. Yeah? Yeah. You're planting. And harvesting. It happens. It does. It's so. fine. And fertilizing. Oh. So. Yeah, it definitely happens then. Yeah, kind of hemorrhaging, but it's okay. Yeah. All right. That's cool. But it's worth it because I'm going to make a lot of money off this bar early. Oh, yeah, you definitely should. Double up my barley. Oh, you're going to do a double? I'm going to do a double and then sell it and hopefully have enough money to buy field 17. That's oh, well. the theory here. All right. Because I don't think one harvest will get me 150000 No. Even, even on you, easy. Yeah, I'll say even on so. easy. Yeah, I don't think that'll quite work like like that. No, nope, don't think so. Might get so. you close. Might get you 100 If it was canola, it might. Yeah. But yeah, I'll just know. wait for the double. Yep. You know, with this combine, they, everything goes pretty quickly. But see the best part about that tree map? Yeah. All the trees are in nice straight rows. Mm. And they're only the good trees that you can cut down with the scorpion. So that's nice. Let's just cut them out with a chainsaw and chip them. Well, you could do that too. Logging or actually selling logs is more fun to me. Shipping. As long as I don't have to load them, it's all good. Yeah. If I, I just mean, have to run loads, that's fine. Yeah. Or if you cut them right, like right into the back of the truck like we were doing that time. or Yeah. That something like bad. that. That's fun. Sure. Yeah, chipping them, chipping them's fine. It's just kind of the easy way out. Yep. Although I actually got that in-game chipper to work finally. I think they updated it. Well, use the uh, use the what's the other one? The buffalo. Okay. And you just back that thing right up to it and you use it like as a table. Hmm. It works quite well actually. It's kind of surprising. Except for when you try to do a whole tree, that doesn't really work. I tried that the other. You day. mean like a real chipper? Yeah. Well, this is like a whole 100 foot. 
right uh tree not so many chippers out there you can put a whole tree in no so no you know. no no especially when it's like you know 24 inch at the base or something. right so. not too many chippers hand maybe it's up grinder yeah not a chipper should have started my planner Pretty sooner much. just saying yeah yeah he's a little behind i wish i could start my planner you could i can't no, you could oh wait you don't have a planner <laughs> tractor do you say with what tractor Maybe you'll get it going next time, John. Technically, I could run my tippers on the on this thing. You could. Like, off the front weight. Right. And just drive backwards. That would be awkward. And slightly. Maybe you'll get that going next time, John. I probably will, actually. So, until then, yeah. we're Mike and John from PumaPlow.com. See ya. Toodles.